Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to do airplane mode on a Monopoly Go. But before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. Now in this case, recently there are a lot of rumors and fake information about a glitch that you could exploit here on Monopoly Go. So before there was proof that you could actually do this from different users, but if you try this doing right now, there might be some repercussions that you uh, might get. So just to give you some idea here, what is the glitch? So the thing here, if you've actually uh, used the glitch uh, method here on Monopoly Go, so this is just for testing purposes. What I like to do here is I want to make sure that I've already, already, already opened up Monopoly Go here and I want to turn on my airplane mode here. And whenever I roll something while in airplane mode here, I'll be able to see what are my, or in this case, what are the rolls that I'll be getting on my account. So let's just start rolling here. So this is just a times one, but you could use another. So currently we got around, so this is just like a uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. So we got a 10 here. Let's go and roll another one here. And we got a like six seven uh, six i oh, got a 10 again and let's go ahead and roll another one and we got a four so in this case we got 10 10 and four so the thing here is when you actually exit monopoly go here while well, still in airplane mode we could go ahead and just double click or press and hold on it we want to click on the eye icon here and want to click on clear data here and click on clear all data and click on OK. So once we've done that, we should be able to turn on our internet or disable uh, airplane mode here. And once you access Monopoly Go here and, and basically re-lock in, it's going to reset everything for us. So instead of us getting the previous numbers that we just recorded, we'll get a different one if we actually change a few things. So as you can see, I've just re-logged in into my account here and we're back at our first starting position. So before like what i said before if we change a few things here it will actually change the roles that we'll get here so the thing that you need to change here is going to be the multiply the multiplier itself so for example we want to set this to times three here and start rolling and as you can see we actually got a five a nine we want to roll again and from here we are we got now a let's just see so we now got a six eight and an eight and you could go ahead and start rolling again so in this case it actually kind of works but like i said it's not always that's going to actually work here so in this case this might be kind of difficult because again you have to re-lock in and uh, basically access your account again and again which is something that we don't want to do here because uh, there are some updates that monopoly go actually made on their game so like what I said, some users aren't able to actually use this method here. And again, your, your account is being compromised if you try uh, logging and re-logging again. So just to give you an idea, I actually received this uh, before. So this is just a screenshot that I got here. So just open up our the photo itself. So in this case, if you try logging in and logging out of your account over and over again, you might get the option that says limit warning which in this case, uh, you might not be able to reach or basically uh, log in into your account again, which is something you don't want because you might not be able to access your account for a very long time here, or you might even get banned. So depending on the severity of the uh, issue that you've, or in this case, the exploit that you're doing here. So yeah, so in this case, the exploit itself is actually, uh, Monopoly Go is trying to prevent that. So this case uh is it so is it actually worth it so with the restrictions and the ways that monopoly go is currently fixing this glitch or this issue that i have right now in the game itself uh using this method might not be as worth it as it can be because again your account m what might be blocked or again your account might get in this case banned from the game itself so we need to be careful here not to lose any progress that we made on the game itself especially if you spend actual money or bought a few things here within monopoly go itself you don't want losing those assets or your progress here within monopoly go 
So yeah, like what I said before, there are going to be some restrictions. The um the image that I show shown you before, the restrictions, the lock in restrictions that we uh, get whenever we try logging in and relogging again, just to test out the uh sequence that we what we we might get the in the game itself. But yeah, so in this case, also be wary of external links that you might access for Monopoly Go, especially if someone is actually offering you, hey, we could actually give you better sequence. So in this case, be aware of those external links and they could actually damage your phone and basically steal your personal data. So yeah, so in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.